Hey guys, what's up? It's me again. Uh, as you guys want, well, you guys might be wondering how I know Leslie Chen. Well, actually, I didn't know her first when I came here, but when I first came here, I was new in the high school and she introduced it to me. And the first time I know that she and Eric are dating, but it's kind of weird <laughs> because. I never seen people think in high school anyway, so that was my first time seeing it. When it was my first time going to McGee Secondary School, yeah, that's where I go for the first time. Um, from that, I know her like, kind of like five years, but yeah, I know longer than that, but yeah. After that, um, after I came and then I met Kate in Africa. After I came to Africa, when Leslie graduated, I met Maya, Eugenia, and Morgan. Kind of like, they come together at once, but yeah, and I know them, and then they're my friends, and yeah, and Hiccup, which is my friend Leslie Chen, nickname is, her nickname is Hiccup. She is, um... She is one of my girlfriends, I love her, and she loves me a lot, I love her too, but then after that we kept on fighting because I don't know what she was fighting over dating a boy in high school, but just that, it's kind of weird for me, she said, but it's weird that I don't know why, but I get so mad when she, when I saw she and Ariel dating and all the, all the stuff and uh, holding hand, all the crap stuff, so... Yeah, I wouldn't say that, but that's how that whole, whole that's a whole shit of that, and I don't really like it because that's the first time I see them dating. I never seen them dating before in high school, and I never see anyone like kiss and stuff. Like, oh gosh, I, I can't even imagine. So, yeah, if you guys are wondering how I met her, I met her in high school, and then the first time I know they were holding hand, and then we kept on fighting, fighting, fighting because it's kind of weird that. When you date in high school, does it feel right for you to do that? And even a teacher doesn't know, and the parents do know, but actually, yeah, it's kind of weird to date in high school, so I would rather not date in high school, because it's not a good feeling to date in high school, because if you date in high school, the feeling gets more different. That you want to broke up, you want to be friend, and you want to not date them anymore. Yeah, I, I just said, I never tried, but I just said, I have the feeling the first time when Leslie Chen dated Eric Pahima. That's my feeling that I got into. And it was a normal feeling. It was a different feeling that I have. So then me and Leslie Chen were on the same school bus. Me, I was listening to music. She was listening to her music. She was like, not sitting beside me, but the seat was that the side of it but yeah and after that she was sitting beside me every time and then after after we fight we'd sit separately and then she would sit with Eric but I listen to him and we sit and I, I like I don't care whatever is going on and I don't know what's going on in her mind and her brain because it's kind of like not right to do that and that's kind of like for me for my feeling kind of like a little hurt because she's like she loved Eric more than me it's like oh, holy shit like I can't really think of that but if you think of if you guys like they in high school if you think that there's a different feeling on you then everybody has but it's kind of weird that when Leslie Chen dated Eric Human in high school Mickey that I have the feeling that she would let me out and all this crap and stuff. And I don't know, I, I don't know how I get that feeling, but I just do it the first time when I didn't see them ladies. So I got so mad, angry. I didn't talk to her at all, neither Eric. I didn't even talk to anybody, but I talked to the teacher about it. And and I, and I told them how I feel about it because I, like, I can't feel left out by her and Eric. So then, so then the teacher and I and Eric and Leslie were all three dealing with it, so then it's not okay to let people out, and I feel like that way, so the first time when I see Eric and Leslie dating, I got so upset, totally, I totally flipped out, I totally like, just flipped out, and I don't know why, but I just totally got so mad, I was so upset, I was crying, 
I totally was so upset that why they were dating and I never seen them dating before because if they were dating, why didn't she told me in the first place instead of me going to Mickey in the first place and see them dating. If she told me I wouldn't go to Mickey at all because it's like, I just totally flipped out. I don't know why. My brain, my brain, my body is just like not normal. So I totally flipped out. So then I walk around and I calm myself down. I tried, I tried everything, but it didn't work because they're still dating. And after that, they broke up because of me. And after that, they should get back together. Like, this a game. Broke up, back together, broke up, back together. But this is not a game. And this is not a prank. I said, I totally flip up. When you see in your own eyes that when you see someone that is, that is your friend, the first time that you met them in high school, that they're your friend. And then you see them holding hands. And you see them kissing and all the stuff like that. To, you guys will think... You guys will flip out. Well, I see in my own eyes. I just uh, totally flip out. My brain, my mind, my body is not thinking about anything. I just, we're just, I was thinking about them kissing and all the stuff because they did. And they were holding hand, of course. But they didn't let the teacher know that. And because, you know, the teacher rules not no dating in high school until maybe you graduate from high school. But, yeah. And I graduated last June. And she graduated a long, long time ago last year. So I totally flipped out, so I don't know why. Just got that feeling. But hopefully you guys will never date in high school, because if you do, I'm going to warn you that you will get the same feeling that you will flip out, and that you will never want to go to high school again. That's how I do. That's my feeling. My feeling was so hurt. I thought, oh my gosh, I'm not thinking of that. Yeah. I was, the first time I was thinking that to quit Mickey, but I talked to the teacher about it. We discussed it. And we solved the problem, which is good. So that kept on staying with me regular school because that's the high school that I only can have. So my other teacher behind my house, I have a one elementary school I go to, and that and that after elementary, like grade seven, my other teacher got me into Mickey, and I said, "Oh gosh, if I first know that Leslie was here, I wouldn't have gone to Mickey yet until." Right now, I could go, but that was like whole crap of stuff. So hopefully, you guys won't do that anymore, and hopefully, you guys will. Well, yeah. But if you see a text that saying, "Hey, baby, you wanna hang out? You wanna come to my house? You wanna have? Uh, I wanna hug you. I wanna see you. All stuff." When you see in your own life, just flip out, man. I just flip out. I don't know why, but I just totally have a. Temper tantrum. I don't know why, but I just do. I just cry. I just calm myself down, but I didn't let the teacher know until after that when I calmed down. And I didn't touch it that day. I didn't do anything. But anyways, that was a long time ago, and that's why I'm going to tell you guys that you should not do that in high school. That's not what it is. High school is for school and not for dating. That's the rule of high school that teachers have. So, yeah, anyways, I still love you, Hiccup. You're my best girlfriend ever. And, yeah, I just do love you. And hopefully we can hang out again on the 29th on Friday, 1 o'clock at Mitchelltown. And hopefully we will have some fun again. Do we, I will do some more video later. So peace out. Peace out. Peace out. Bye. I love you, Hiccup, forever. <laughs>